Good morning. I have decided to give this YouTube thing another try, except this time instead of my two minute recap weekly videos, I'm going to talk to the camera. I'm going to vlog. I'm going to do the whole bit. So bear with me. We'll see how this goes. We'll see how I stick with it. But I thought it would be fun to kick off with Thanksgiving weekend. So I have a lot of stuff to do today. I'm going to go get ready and then we'll get into it. Not sure how this lighting is, but we're gonna make do. Um, like I said, we're testing, we're learning. I'll get a ring light if I need to. Just got out of the shower. I'm gonna do my skincare and some light makeup. I need to go into my office to ship products for one of um, the campaigns that I'm working on right now. And my agency is closed today, but some of the other ones in my building are not. So I don't wanna look completely disheveled, um, but I also don't wanna like, get fully ready like I would if I were going into the office all day. So we're going to find a happy medium, but that's first on the list. I also need to like run to UPS, get a box to run to like a TJ Maxx or a Marshall's and get, um, the casserole baking dishes. We are staying in New York for Thanksgiving. Obviously I'm in my apartment. My friends Kelly and Brennan are hosting and we are in charge of bringing green bean casserole and corn casserole. And I have one casserole dish. It's not very deep. So I need to go get some that are a little bit deeper. Then after that, I have um, a gift card to Abercrombie from the Creator Suite. And I just love Abercrombie and they're having really good Black Friday sales. So I'm gonna stop by Abercrombie. I think I'm actually gonna go to the new location on Fifth Avenue because I haven't been since it opened. After that, I'm gonna head to Whole Foods because I need to get ingredients to make the casserole. And I'm on a mission to find Rhodes Rolls. If you know, you know. I don't think that they even sell them in New York. I'm convinced that they don't, but try. So I might end up going to several grocery stores other than Whole Foods to see if I can find those. And then I need to come home and clean my apartment. I have a mountain of laundry that I need to do. I was in Las Vegas last week for the Las Vegas Grand Prix. And then I flew to Austin for one of my best friend's weddings. Michael worked all week and then flew to Austin for that same wedding. And so our apartment is just so disheveled. There's so much laundry. It's driving me insane. So that will be my afternoon. This is so chaotic. You guys are going to watch this and be like, mm, maybe reconsider your life choices. People that record on their phone, like, how do you do it? <laughs> because my back camera is obviously so much better. So I'm using my back camera right now, but I can't A, see myself, which I feel like is a problem because I don't know what you're seeing. And also... I just, like, I can't check the lighting. I can't do anything. I d obviously don't want to buy a camera until I decide I'm going to commit to this. So maybe that'll be, like, a New Year's gift to myself. In the meantime, this is what we get. And we're just going to hope it works. Okay, here is the final fit. I need to get a stand to put my mirror on so you can see my outfit a little bit better, up closer. But here's what I landed on. I'm wearing just my everyday New Balances, aloe leggings, a Uniqlo heat tech layer underneath, and then I threw this jacket on top just to make things look a little bit more elevated while I'm in the office. And then, of course, I have my Triple Gemini tote. I'm wearing really simple jewelry. I have on my 444 necklace and then just some studs, hoops, and then a slick back like you saw while I was getting ready. All right, let's go. Almost forgot my office ID, which would have been bad. Bigger news, my shipping tape is gone. The bubble wrap is still here, but the tape is gone, which is problematic because 
how am I supposed to take this up? Fortunately, I'm a genius and I got a backup option, but I don't know about this. So we're gonna try it out and see. Okay, so the tape is nowhere to be found, but that's okay. I ended up just packing it in this, which seems to work. I bubble wrapped it and this is padded with bubble wrap already. So I think we'll be okay. I just did the label. I need to take this TPS, drop it off, and then I'm gonna head out to run the rest of my errands. Okay, so I'm headed to TPS, but it is actually such a nice day, and I think instead of going to the Fifth Avenue Abercrombie, I'm gonna walk up to Soho. I haven't been to that one either. I think it's new as well, and I think I'm gonna go to that one. So let's go. to figure out a filming setup what is currently happening is not it you are on a stack of books but that's a problem for another day I thought I would show you everything I bought on my little excursion so we're gonna start with TJ Maxx so first up I mentioned I needed casserole dishes got those these are Martha Stewart they were literally $6.99. We love that. I got two of them. Next up, I grabbed some storage containers for leftovers for tomorrow because I'm sure we'll have some. These are always great to have on hand. These were also so cheap. I think they were like $4. There's not a price on them, but I'm pretty sure they were $4. And lastly from TJ Maxx, I got just some sheer tights to wear under my outfit tomorrow, which leads me into my small but iconic Abercrombie haul. First up, this skirt. I am obsessed with. The material is amazing. It has layers, shorts underneath, which, you know, such a win. I got this one in a medium. I tried on the large. I'm typically in between, but the large was way too big. The skirt is $70, but right now they're having a Black Friday sale and I think I'm gonna upload this video on Sunday, so it should still be going. If it is, I'll put my code and my link in the description box and as text overlay because you need this. I got a dress for tomorrow. It's Thanksgiving, I wanna be cute. So, here she is. Isn't she amazing? The satin material, we have the ruching at the top. I got this one in a size medium tall. Love that Abercrombie is selling their dresses in tall sizes now. I am not tall, however, I do have long legs and so things tend to be a little short on me. Put it on and knew it was perfect, had to have it. That's the haul. Um, not a ton, but very happy with what I did purchase. I think I'm gonna go back to Abercrombie probably Friday or Saturday because as I mentioned, they have that Black Friday sale going and there's so much I wanna buy. But today we're on a mission. So next up, I'm gonna eat something really quickly and then I'm gonna head out to the grocery store. So let's go. Okay, I'm back and I'm sweaty and disgusting. But here's what happened. I went to Target because I needed some things like hairspray. I didn't have anything I needed in terms of like actual ingredients to make my recipes. So I popped on over to Whole Foods. You can see my bags in the back. Um, went well, thought I had everything I needed. I went down the escalator and realized I forgot the bread, which is arguably the most important part. So I went back at the escalator and not surprisingly, they did not have the bread that I needed. They had, dinner rolls, 
I think these will get the job done. We'll butter them. They'll be great. Problem number one solved. Problem number two came as I was checking out. I realized I forgot the corn for the corn casserole, which is obviously the number one ingredient in corn casserole. I didn't know what to do in that moment. I was like, should I finish checking out, go back up, come back down, check out again? Should I go to a different grocery store? I ultimately decided to go to a different grocery store because I didn't wanna go through the whole food situation again. Went to another grocery store, bought one singular can of corn and I'm finally home, ready to unpack my groceries. I'm gonna change and then I've got to get my life together because my apartment is a disaster and I cannot take it another second. I also need to get better about not looking at myself and looking at the camera. Hi. We got Scout's food delivered today and he recognizes Chewy boxes now because he always gets a toy when he gets new food. So he knows I have something behind my back. You good boy? Did you get a gingerbread man? Okay, it is a lot later now. Michael's in the background playing video games with friends. I am so tired. I put on my eye patches and um, I am clearly in bed. I think I'm just gonna read and have a chill night. We are going to the parade super early tomorrow morning and we have a full day of activities so I want to make sure that I'm well rested. Good morning and happy Thanksgiving! We are running a little bit late but we are going to quickly get ready and go get coffee and go to the parade. I got ready so quickly for the parade but I'm wearing my New Balances, these leggings that are from I think Old Navy, another heat tech layer, this Abercrombie just like crew neck pullover on top. New Yorker nowhere hat. My hair is just in a ponytail. I'm going to throw my big, thick puffer jacket on top, and we are ready to go. Are you excited for the parade? Yeah. What balloon are you most excited to see? Santa Claus. It's not a balloon, but I'll give it to you. I'm excited to see Santa, too. On our way home, I still need to make both casseroles and see my dress, get ready. Michael needs to pick out what he's wearing, um, so we're off to do that. Our casseroles are going. We've got the green bean casserole in here. Corn casserole is mixed. No idea if I did it right, but we're gonna find out. The green bean casserole is done and it's looking so good. We still need to add a few more crunchy onions on top and bake those for five more minutes, but we're gonna do that once we get to Kelly and Brennan's. It is a lot later, but I am ready for Thanksgiving. I'm wearing these Amazon boots, tights that I got from TJ Maxx yesterday. This is the Abercrombie dress. I'm obsessed with it. My hair is curled. I have in a headband, really simple gold earrings. Here's the makeup. All right, let's go, we're late. Playing with fire by holding this with one hand. What are you most excited for? Mashed potatoes. Same. Hopefully they're better than last year. Last year we got them from a place and they were not good. But this year, Kelly and Britta made them, so probably going to be good.
y'all had a great Thanksgiving. I kind of think I did a bad job of recording clips last night, but hopefully you got the gist. Um, Michael has to work today, unfortunately, but we are going to take Scout on a quick walk, go get coffee, and then I'm going to figure out what I'm going to do with my day. Probably clean my apartment because I still haven't done that. I feel bad because we're taking Scout to get coffee, but he thinks that we're going to Central Park and we just don't have time for that today. So he's going to be disappointed. It has been the laziest of all lazy days. I just took the longest nap. Um, Michael, as you can hear in the background, is being an angel and <laughs> cleaning the apartment. Um, I think we're going to just continue our lazy day and pick up Chick-fil-A for dinner. So we're going to take Scout on a walk and go do that. you good morning it is what day is it saturday saturday we don't have a ton on the agenda today it's the last regular season day of college football so we're gonna be watching college football probably all day we're about to take scout to central park and then i'm gonna go to target and get <coughs> christmas decorations i'm so excited to decorate we're only gonna be here half the month so we're not doing anything too crazy but It'll be fun to make it festive in here. And then I'm gonna make chili for dinner tonight. And those are the plans. Okay, it's 34 degrees outside, so I think it's time to break out cold weather stuff. Got my gloves. I think I'm gonna do ear warmers instead of a beanie, if I can find it. There we go. All right, we're set. Walk outfit. New balances, as always. I'm wearing Barefoot Dreams fuzzy socks because it's so cold. Aloe leggings. I have on an Abercrombie Just Graphic long sleeve tee. I have on my Killington, oh, nope, Palm Springs <laughs> crew neck, big puffer jacket, ear warmers. I'm going to put on gloves. Let's go. gonna do a lot but they had this tree and I just couldn't not get it it's the perfect size for our table we don't actually use this table so it's perfect we're gonna decorate it now decorated she's so small but cute target honestly didn't have a ton of ornament options i feel like they were kind of picked over don't mind our second tv set up in the background it's a uh, college game day but anyway i went with the black and gold and silver theme mostly black and silver there's a little snowman back here not snowman that's santa claus santa claus these little gnomes some stars. I'm not going to put anything on top because I feel like if I do, it'll fall over, but she's here. She's perfect. Chili is on. This recipe is so good. It's just um, a can of tomato sauce, a can of petite diced tomatoes. I use one can of Rotel, ground turkey, 
one small white onion diced and then season it with chili powder, cumin, and paprika. And it is so yummy. I am obsessed. I'll put the recipe down below in the description box. Okay, it's been simmering for like an hour and a half. It looks so good, but I have to know, are you a beans and chili kind of person or a no beans and chili kind of person? I'm a beans and chili kind of person. I add them separately and I know that that makes me less Texan, but you know what? I'm okay with that. Good morning and happy Sunday. We have made it to the last day of this first vlog. I feel like this is such a rough draft. I'll do better in the future, I promise. And again, another probably lazy day. We're about to take Scout to Central Park and then I'm gonna go grocery shopping. I'll take you along with me for that. And then I'm gonna edit this and post it. So let's get in to Sunday. Groceries are unloaded. I'm gonna sit down and edit this vlog. Let me know what you think. I promise I'll do better next week. Bye!